welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Anaya, and if you are new here, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And if you are a returning craft bestie, put a pink heart. And if you are a new craft bestie, put a yellow heart. So as y'all read by the title, today's video, I'm going to let Pinterest pick everything I crochet for the day. Well, it's probably not even just about to be for the day because I got stuff on my Pinterest board that might take, tell, that might take like a day or two. So we're going to let Pinterest pick. Okay, so let's go ahead and look on my Pinterest. I have two Pinterest crochet boards. Um, so we're going to pick the one where I put like my most recent stuff I want to make on there. So we're going to do that one. So let me go ahead and screen record. And y'all, follow my Pinterest. I'm going to put it like right here because I need to get more active on there. I need to get more active on all my socials. But sometimes I just, I don't be feeling like it. So let's see what we got. I like this bag, but I don't want to commit to no project that big today, so we're not going to do it. But if y'all like this video, I'm going to make a part two, because I already want to make a part two, because there's so much stuff I want to make. I wanted to make a book cover, but I feel like that's boring. I want to make one of these scrap hats, these scrap beanies. Hmm. We're going to pick three projects to do. We're going to pick three. So... I know I'm making a balaclava because I already got some granny squares that I found yesterday when I cleaned my closet. And I don't want these granny squares to go to uh, waste. So we're going to use them. So we're going to make one of these. Oh, I have been wanting to make a scarf. I feel like this is the perfect opportunity because it's on my Pinterest board. So And Pinterest telling me what to crochet. So we're probably going to make one of them. Um, This is cute. That is cute. I'm not gonna do one like that, but this too big, but I'm gonna make one of these dishes. Y'all always I always see this purse. I wanna make this one day. I know y'all gonna keep getting y'all gonna get tired of me saying, I wanna make this, I wanna make this, I wanna make this. Girl, just make it. But if you crochet, you know it's not that easy. Like it's not that easy. Like you can crochet whatever you want at any time, but you just have so many options and so many possibilities. Hmm. Yeah, we're gonna make this. We're gonna make this hat Kalani got on because that is cute. And I've been wanting to make a wavy brim green square hat. So we're gonna go ahead and make that. So let's just do a recap. I'm gonna try to put like some pictures. We're gonna do this one. This one. The video for the day. So we're making a scarf, a balaclava, and a wavy brim green square hat. Okay, so for Christmas, I got so much yarn. Like all of these is new. All of these is new um i tried to use the ombre yarn for the uh scarf i might use this yarn because that'll be cute i might use this so we're gonna use that for the uh the scarf and then for the Granny Square hat, let me let me figure out some colors. Okay, so I got all my options. So this is going to be for the wavy brim Granny Square hat. I don't know why it's showing up darker on the camera, but they really kind of like this the only dark color. And then for my scarf, I'm going to be using this Caron cake. It was a um, Christmas gift. And it's called, because I know y'all going to ask, uh, Cabano. Caban, Caban, I don't know. But that's that. And I told y'all I already had some granny squares made from a project. I don't remember what project it was. So I'm going to use these for the balaclava. And it's going to be like a scrap balaclava. So I'm about to go ahead and get started. I'm not going to put myself on a time limit. I'm just going to crochet, crochet, crochet. And then hopefully we done with everything by... I don't know. Um, today is the 4th. It's Thursday, January the 4th. So hopefully we're done with everything by Saturday. Because it's, it's, it's really not that much to do. Like, these, I only got to do, like, it's, it's not going to be that much, hopefully. So I'm going to do, like, a little montage or something. So. Okay, so I just finished all the squares for the balaclava. I didn't leave my hands in yet. Close your eyes. Don't be a, don't be judging. 
So let's go ahead and start the granny squares for the um or I could I I don't know if I'm about to piece this together now. I'll go ahead and start the squares for the um the other hat. Okay, just a little update. I finished the balaclava with sewing all the squares together. I am gonna go ahead and do like a little border to just even up this even all this out um i like it i'm probably gonna either sell it or let my sister have it because i don't really like the color scheme but it's still cute it's still cute but i finished the balaclava and this is it it is a little big and i didn't weave the ends in so i know what i should have did last time i'm about to show y'all the other ones so this is the one i had made for my sister and as you can see, it's not as big as this one because I use a different size hook. But I guess it just gave a different look. I mean, neither one of them are ugly. I like both of them. I just wouldn't personally wear either one of them because this one looks too tight for me. So I just got to figure out like a good size hook and stuff to get it perfect or semi-perfect. So we are about to get into the next project. But I got bad news. I got bad news. I got bad news. I kind of don't want to make a scarf no more. So I'm about to go on my Pinterest and figure out what else on here I want to make. And if push come to shove, I'll just make um my book cover. Because I really do need like a cute little book cover. Or like that's cute. That's cute, but it's also plain. Like we're supposed to be doing fun stuff like. I don't know what I want to make. I don't know. So I'm going to figure it out. And when I figure it out, I'll come back. But I guess until then, I could go ahead and start on the hat. So I think that's what I'm about to do. Okay, so anyways, it is currently 8.26. I took a little break because I had to run to the hair store and stuff, but I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I've been crocheting since I got home. Like, I've been sitting here for like an hour finishing up these granny. Started making my granny squares for my hat. And that's the colorway. Focus. I probably can't see it for real, for real, but that's the colorway. And I also decided that we're not going to do the scarf in this video. I'm going to do the scarf in this video because I never made a scarf and I don't want the scarf to be ugly. And I'm like, mm, humble. So we're not going to do a scarf in this video. I'm probably going to do my scarf on my own time. But instead, I am going to make me a book cover because I really do want one. I be throwing my book in my purse and... My book, some of my books be looking good condition, but some of them be looking real. Like, they just need some, some, some loving. Because I be messing them up, just throwing them in my purse and stuff. So, I've been looking at these granny square book covers. But it's really not a granny square, like multiple granny squares. It's really just like one big granny square folded. Oh, they added like little bowls. That is cute. I love that little bow aesthetic y'all got going on, but I don't know how to tie a bow, so we're not doing that. But we're going to do this. And I'm probably going to just use, like, some scraps in my closet. Let me look for... I'm not about to look for no scraps right now. I'll probably do that tomorrow, but I am about to go ahead and finish up this hat. And I already know y'all going to ask me when I finish it for a tutorial. It's coming. It's coming. Just bear with me. It's coming. So hey y'all, it is Friday, it's the next day, and I finished everything. So I finished my three projects. So this is the hat I think I left off. Now I didn't weave no ends in for nothing, so don't say nothing. Shoot. So this is the hat. It looked better on, I promise. I'm gonna try it on. And then this is the book cover. I even added like a little button. And it's just so cute. It came out a little wider. Wide. 
But once you put the book in it, you're not even really going to tell. Okay, so first thing up, we have the balaclava. I'm turning it real stiff. It was ugly at first, but I kind of like it. It's kind of big, but I feel like if it wasn't so big, it'd be cute. So let's do like a little 360. <laughs> so that's that. Right. I mean, let me cut this down so, so y'all can fully see. I didn't mean to cut the whole light off, but this is the hat. I wish y'all could like, like it's so cute. Wait, wait. Let's at least get a little bit of light. Can y'all see? Can y'all see? Once I weave in all the ends. Now I did use a 4.25 millimeter hook and I used to always use that hook with my granny squares and I got that tight fit. So I think I'm in love. Like I am in love. This hat is so cute. <gasps> oh my God, I wish it would like, pick up the colors. And I wouldn't be me if I didn't tell y'all what I was reading. My new, my current read for right now is I wish it would focus. I guess it's too much like highly um suspicious and unfairly cute. It's good so far. So that's what I'm reading. And I got my new little book cover. I have two book covers. So this is one a while back. And it got like the little button. So I got two book covers. So let's put the book in so I can show y'all. A book girl accessory or just like a book accessory crochet video <gasps> oh my god <gasps> that is so cute once I weave in the ends for everything everything is just gonna be 10 times cuter and I had this color left over and it wasn't enough to make a hat so I was like let me just make it into something small and this was the perfect project so and then I got this one. I know y'all gonna ask, so I'm gonna show y'all anyway. Well, nobody asked yet, but I'm gonna show y'all anyway. And then that is this way. This way. Oh my gosh. Just cute. Just cute. Everything is just cute. And I remember I said I probably was gonna give this away. I'm gonna keep it for me because I don't ever keep stuff for myself. I always end up giving it away or selling it. And 2024, I need to stop doing that. So I don't want I don't want the video to end. Like, I don't want the video to end. I want to make some more stuff, but that's okay. We're gonna make a part two. And we're gonna do a we're gonna do another one of these. So thank y'all for watching. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. And if y'all have any videos y'all wanna see, comment down below or y'all can even text me on Instagram. Like, we locked in. We are craft besties. Don't act like strangers. And Bye, y'all. I don't know what else to say. <laughs>